We have to have the video one. Oh no, this, this is... I think I played piano on yeah, this one. My Wi-Fi battles, holy shit. Oh my god. I used to be on Vega? What? Hey, to be fair, Nick is the Feralicator on you! Touché! Yeah, we're watching old videos. I've had enough to drink that I can actually tolerate watching this crap. Almost oh my god to play Ian. Why would you stay in on a fucking Why would you stay in? Dude! I suck at competitive battle. What do you expect? <laughs> do, 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 do. Bum, da, 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 da. I used to know how to play this on the piano. Well, part of it. Didn't know how to play the whole thing. Like I I listened to it and I was able to like find the melody. I wasn't able to actually, like, play both games or make it sound legit, but... God, I want to do YouTube again so bad! How did I get a shiny Umbreon? A lot of these Pokémon were traded to me. Some of them were probably hacked. I don't know which ones actually were. I tend to assume all the shinies were hacked, but I'm pretty sure the Skarmory I had was legit. Because the Skarmory I had didn't have perfect IVs. And like, if you're gonna hack a Pokemon, why would you hack it with imperfect IVs? Like, that doesn't make a lot of sense. I still have these Pokemon, by the way. They're all still on my copy of Diamond. I'm surprised they used a tentacle. Is tentacle even viable in fourth gen? Yes. Guess that's why I used it. Wait, you had a chopple berry on your upper? <laughs> Is that bad? <laughs> What? I don't even know what that does. Was it bad? <laughs> what? <laughs> God. Uh, I guess I. Hold on. Let me change my stream title. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, just chatting. No, not jump ultimate stars. This was like something people did back in 2008, guys. They just uploaded shitty Wi Fi battles. With music I know, ever. right? It's so bad. And people actually watched this crap. This video has almost as many views as my two year anniversary. Do you know how much effort my two year anniversary took versus this? Why, why, why would you stay? Why would you stay? Okay, never mind. Yeah, focus on this. Took why as, would you stay in? This took as much effort to make. Or, or, like, the two year anniversary took, like, days to make. This took me as long as it took to film the battle. <laughs> Effort is not proportional to views out. And that's so sad, too. Like... Nice. Did I win this? I don't even remember if I won this. I think, I think you lost it. I might have lost it. I'm doing at least one new video with the camcorder. 
the videos where I do my side, like my side series where I do the, um, kind of like the podcast talking about the Pokemon generations, I might go back and use my old footage for the halls. I haven't decided yet. But I'm gonna need video footage, so I might go back and draw footage from that. Oh wait, I think you actually got this one. I don't remember what you have. Well, my Snorlax is freaking OP. Snorlax is so good. I loved Snorlax. Snorlax is one of my favorite Pokemon. I used it in the Battle Frontier, too. In fact, this Snorlax was actually probably my Battle Frontier trained Snorlax. I'm like 98% sure that was my Battle Frontier Snorlax that I duplicate glitched over to 4th gen. Yeah, I, I did tape my DS to a wall. Like, that's not even a, like, some mystery anymore. Like, I, what I would do is I would legit take my 3DS and I'd tape it to a wall. You'd still get some wiggle, though, which is unfortunate. Like, hold on. <laughs> it's very flimsy, but this was my... Oh, I did two battles! This is the one where I did play on the piano. But yeah, this is um, the, the DS Lite that I used. It has a broken L button. It served me very well. And I'd like, basically what I'd do is I'd take my DS, I'd set it like this, and then I'd put tape here and here. And I'd tape it up against the back mirror on my bedroom dresser. <laughs> And then I'd put the camcorder, like, here, pointed at the screen. And I'd have to put the DS on books so that it would, like, balance out the level. So the DS would be, like, on one or two books. And that's how I'd film it. And that's me playing the piano. If nothing else, back in the day, I was really passionate. And that's part of the reason I stopped doing YouTube, was because I'm not the kind of person who half-asses stuff. Like, I don't like half-assing stuff. So, I guess when I lost, when I felt like I couldn't put my 100% into YouTube, that's why I stopped doing it. Would I explain the L button being wonky, or was that something else? Uh, the L, the L button on the old on the uh, DS lights would was kind of flimsy. It was susceptible to breaking. The L and R buttons were both susceptible to breaking. Basically, I figured it out because I learned how to use the L button. There's like a little button, like a little piece inside the button that presses up against what triggers the L and R input in the Nintendo DS. So, like, until I got a new... I, I did get a new DS Lite after that white one, um, but until I did, like, I could stick a paper clip or something inside the L button, like, there was a way to pull it out and, like, stick something into it. And you can press the button manually with, like, a paper clip. That's what I did. There weren't many games that required you to use the L button, but it was a pain in the butt when you did need it, and there was one part in Chrono Trigger where you needed the L button. <laughs> oh yeah, this was Majora's fan's birthday, I forgot. I think his birthday's actually Halloween. No, it's the day before Halloween. So I did that video as a birthday type of thing. Alright, it's 
time for the act. It's time for the ultimate reaction. Hold on, I'm listening to good music. Oh my god. Oh, that's why I did Song of Storms on piano the second time. Because in the first battle, I did the original Song of Storms. <laughs> yeah, this was my competitive Skarmory. I think this Skarmory was legit. I'm pretty sure this Skarmory was legit. It had a good nature and it was shiny. What the fuck, 2008? I know, right? Oh yeah, I did a video from Darkrai. I forgot about that. God Darren David. McDougal! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I remember that name. This guy convinced me to make a fan Pokemon game with him. Oh, we never did. <laughs> but we were supposed to make a fan Pokemon game. I actually wrote two songs for it. I've played those songs before on stream. Do 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 do. Also the Smash music. I wonder... I, I still have his uh, Pokemon design saved somewhere. I wonder if I can easily find them without taking forever. I'll let you guys know, because I'm looking right now. Why did you have Brick Brick on your Why did I what? Why did you have Brick Brick on your hair? <laughs> Because that was my Battle Frontier Heracross. This team was my mostly my Battle Frontier team. Where was the Close Combat? I don't think Close Combat existed in 3rd Gen. This is 4th Gen! That was my 3rd Gen Battle Frontier team. Okay, damn. Let, let me specify, that was my 3rd Gen Battle Frontier team. Okay, there we go, that... Is this it? No, this is it. Yeah, it'll it'll be really hard to find this. Wait. Well, I found the two songs. I found the two songs that I wrote. 